Hello dear ones, are you flying high? Are you soaring to new views? Are these elevated vibrations sinking into your way of being? Are you noticing your own energy feels so much better? That's really just more of you being here, you know. It's not US. It's just more and more of you. And what makes you more you, is your openness and your alignment. Your permission. Your gradual building of your energy field. It is a powerful thing to contact your own fullness, your own higher vibrational energies. It is a powerful thing in human form to open to your own, higher vibration fields and use this connection to build your presence. How very smart of you. How very wonderful for everything that is that you have come forth in this way at this time. Don't you know, beloveds, the universe wants to play with you. The more you embody your own fullness and, and we say this with great emphasis, the more present you are on earth, the more you fill out your lower chakras and your body, with the fullness of you, integrating it all through the infinite wisdom of your sacred heart. The more fun you can have. The more the universe can play here, through you. And with you, mind you, through you as you. This is felt within the wholeness, the universal heart of life, the creator God soaring high on planet earth, wow, is it good to see, to feel, to know, to share in. So realize the universal aspect of you, that fully confident universal aspect of your own presence. It's in there, in your energy field, the universal you, the universal wisdom you are, the universal spirit you are, the universal presence you are, and also the universal Laurel and Hardy that you are. Laurel and Hardy were an American comedy team and this is what you are with your universal aspect, a team that knows how to have fun. Your universal aspects want to play with you and the universe as a whole wants to play with you. Don't you see the humor in the guidance you get? Don't you see the humor in the little winks the world gives you? People with the last name light when you're looking for a new home, a place you discover now that is known for growing apples, when you grew up on Apple Tree Lane, a place even where your favorite cartoonist, the one who drew that silly, fun, loving dog Snoopy, lived, and Snoopy, the Peanuts comics being a favorite of yours and discovering the place you're thinking about moving has an airport named after this man who drew these wonderfully love-filled amazingly playful comics with kids and a dog. Do you see how much fun you can have here? Do you see that you get to choose? That you get to choose how it happens for you? So beloved beings, we want to invite you to drop any remaining seriousness that you feel about your earth life and open to the playfulness within the universal and bring yourself into more fun and in essence into more harmony, more unity of spirit. Earth life has been so oh serious. Enlightenment seeking, self-aware humans have become so serious. About so many things. Fighting for this. Feeling the need to transmute that. Feeling they must help with this. Feeling they must fix that. Step into your glory and let all those projects of should, ought to, have to, need to, must, go. Let go of all the ideas that some things are better, cooler, more spiritual, more loving and just see without any filters that are value laden. What do you want? What would get you giggling? What could you open into that would just really make your toes curl up and your heart sing? What would give you that elated, enthusiastic feeling you had in your best childhood moments? Not that you want to repeat your childhood, but you want that vibe, plus the more you, the universal you which is coming forth in this now moment. The universal you is so confident. It's so sure of love. It's so filled up. It's so capable and so resourced and so connected and so perpetual that it just is and so when the universal you enters the game, you start to want more pleasure. You drop all the other things. You just become more true to you, naturally. Without effort. You start to want ease. You start to want fun and silliness. Playfulness. You don't worry about drinking a little too much wine, sleeping a little too late laughing a little too loud, saying exactly what you think. 
You feel yourself start to be you with a little amplification and release of all the mandates, and it's so liberating. Your body is going to really start to hum when you go there. When you go with you. When you go with what you're feeling, what you're thinking. Because being true to you, is alignment. It's flow. And then in the midst of all this you are going to start being able to see so much humor in stuff. Do you notice the great mystics of your history all had a kind of irreverent sense of humor? They found all kinds of things amusing. Funny even. Laugh out loud or gentle smile funny, but funny. That's because it's a game. It's a game. Did you forget? Of course you didn't but you haven't yet really let that inform you, create you, structure your being, dissolve your limiting ideas and beliefs. Why don't you invite that to happen? Why don't you question everything and see if you really still like it, feel it, believe it want it around? Why don't you move toward what feels good even if it's just another nap right now? Ha ha ha! Napping! So delicious! Summer coming for some of you, also delicious. Think of how much you lighten up with even the mention of the word summer. How about lazy summer? How about lazy summer afternoon? Doesn't that sound good? Isn't life available to you as one endless lazy summer afternoon? So you don't want them all to feel the same and you don't want boredom, which that may give you the idea of, but you most definitely want play and you most definitely want pleasure. At least if you're soaking up these higher vibes you do, you want it. And you want it because the universe within you wants to play with you through you. As you. Wants to see what you can do together. Wants to use the landscape of your life as a stage in which to unfold new acts that get you hilariously smiling and laughing with the poetic synchronicity and the amazing timing of it all. Humor is all about timing right? And truth. And aliveness is all about alignment and alignment brings forth an expanded experience of timing and a brilliant clarity that sees the truth and the truth of your being and what's singing to you, is all around you and more and more you're going to see it, the little winks from across the room, from the song on the radio, from the little discoveries in your life that show you, all that is is with you. All that is is with you and playing with you and really this is you remembering how to play with different aspects of you. This is what being an eternal field of pure potential consciousness is all about, extending into form and expressing and playing. We encourage you to claim this as your mission, I am here to play with the universal within me. See how your begin lured out into the afternoon sun for some fun. Enjoy it. That's the whole point you know. Expand, create, extend, be aware of it all through enjoyment. Appreciation. Be who you really are, lighten up. I am Archangel Michael.